today I'm finally gonna be doing my desk tour and this has been requested a lot and a lot of you are curious what I have on my desk so I'm gonna show you what I have and this is gonna be my grand desk tour normally my desk is a lot messy but today I organized it and I thought this would be the perfect opportunity to show it to you guys keep in mind that most of my books are on my bookshelf right over there and other books are in another room in my house so I don't really have a lot of books here but I like to keep only the essentials that I like to use. I like to just grab a book right away and study it so I put it right in front of me so I can use it very easily and by the time you watch this video I'm gonna be in China because I'm gonna go there for like two weeks to do an exchange program so follow my Instagram if you want to see updates about that. I will keep you guys updated through my Instagram and for another update my beloved dog Mary, which you guys might have seen in some of my videos, she's a Maltese and she was diagnosed with breast tumor yesterday and we took her to the hospital yesterday and she was diagnosed with that and she took a surgery today. It is just so heartbreaking. If you raise a dog or a cat or any sort of pet, then I'm sure you, you would understand how it feels like to have your pet sick. And that was a really, really big surgery, so she had to stay there for another five days in the hospital. The house isn't the same without her. It's just so silent and quiet. And I don't know, it's not as cheerful as before. And I updated you guys on Instagram and a lot of you sent her blessings. So thank you so much for your kind, heartwarming comments. So that happened. But the good news is there weren't any metastasis, so she's gonna be fine. I just wanted to throw it out there to those of you who don't know what's going on. I just wanted to update you guys on my life. Without further ado, let's get started. So I'm gonna show you how it looks all together. And we will start with the desk. This desk is really huge and it's made out of this wood material. And this is from Hansem Interior, which is a famous Korean interior design brand. And this desk comes with these three shelves and inside it is so really really messy but i'm gonna briefly show you guys on the top i have like my bank stuff and some of like essentials my passport and everything and then on the second i have like some electronics i don't know why this is here this is a soup like a instant cream soup from Utugi. And I like this, but I bought it, but I haven't eaten it since. I have like my previous wallet. I have miscellaneous stuff. And this is a photo card that you can buy after you watch a movie. And I also have a poster on top of my board. And I will show you guys that later. And I have like some of these. I don't really use these. I'm not really like a scrapbook person. And I have some other things right there. And this is a very interesting thing. Um, this is a light for your cell phone. So if you take selfies and you need light, you can just clip it onto your cell phone and then you turn it on. It has like three modes. And yeah, it's really a really weird product. At the bottom shelf, this is also miscellaneous stuff. I have a stethoscope that I don't really use. I have the other one um, somewhere else where I use and then I have these electronic devices that I used in high school and yeah this is another dictionary um, I have some cell phone cases a calculator that I used in the US when I was in high school and then like these little things I have a lot of cell phone cases like, these are all cell phone cases also cell phone cases so yeah, that is that. And on top of here, I have all of my cords. This is for my laptop and this is my Bluetooth speaker and another laptop. And this is for um, my blow dryer. Then starting from the right, we have this thing that I put some of my school supplies in and I bought this in Costco and they came with like this red one and also a green one, but I bought the red one. And on top of it, I have um, my blow dryer and my hair curler 
and stapler and a glasses case and I just keep this here because right next to it is my vanity and it's quite messy so I'm not really gonna show it to you guys but I need some space some extra space so I just put these here and then these are all of my school supplies so in the first shelf well this is also a miscellaneous thing but I have this selfie stick and then this is another like mini tripod from Canon and then I have a new wallet that I haven't used this is from coach and some electronic things and this is I need to fill this out I bought it at Valentine's Day like last year to make chocolate but I didn't really make it and then I have some chocolates some treats and a mouthwash that I got for free somewhere and then a glass wiper and then the second shelf this is my school ID. I just have it here because I'm currently on vacation. And then this is sort of like my electronics thing. And this is a key that I don't really use anymore. And then this is a lip balm and a mirror and some batteries. This Apple sticker, the MacBook instructions, a mouse, um, some batteries, and a pen light. And I also have the scissors, the medical scissors, and some other pens. These are all new. I have these as backup. And then this is the actual pen light. I have two different kinds. And this is like a quick version. The other one, which is right here, this is a more expensive one. You just press this part right here, and then it lights up. And these two have just school supplies, mostly pens because I'm an avid pen lover. So as you can see, there are so many. Um, I have scissors and then like highlighters and pens and I know it's really messy. This is how I like it. Um, I have these computerized pens for exams. If I run out of something, then I open this drawer and get something out that I like. And yeah, so I have, I bought mostly my pens from Costco, so I have a lot of backups. And this one, I have post-its, 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 all different shapes of post-its, and then a tape, and some more pens. And this one I also bought from Costco as well. This is Zebra brand, and I like this pen a lot. I also have a puncher, um, and some other tape, and this is, I think this is a puncher as well moving on i have my pc lg green 14 inch and i've been using this for a long time and i have my bluetooth mouse right here and i put this marble kind of like a sticker thingy on top of it so i can protect it and it's really pretty at the same time so i really really like it and then here is the book stand and this is very very useful it's not really expensive at all it's used to just put books on it and mine is from morning glory this is a korean brand and i just i like it and then on here i have my oxford um kind of a diary thing and i write some of my youtube related plans on here here we have my bose bluetooth speaker at the back we have books and so this is all the books that I have on top of my desk. To start off here, I have the Harrison's Internal Medicine. This is like the Bible of internal medicine. If you go to medical school, you would definitely, definitely know that. This part is like notes and some important stuff. So it's little and medium sized notes to like big ones. And then I have this clipboard and these are all file holders and this is a notebook that i've been using this past year and then these are all new notebooks these are like little mini ones i showed it in another vlog i bought this from costco as well that's why i have so many Ta-da! this is my favorite part this is like also a bible for studying the kmle and if you don't know what KMLE is, it is sort of like a Korean USMLE. I am going to conquer all of this during my winter vacation. Here we have like mini books. This is just a screen wiper for my MacBook. And then this one is the diary that I've been using last year. This is from Starbucks. And underneath it, we have the Allski book. And then this is the CPX book. 
we have some other famous power internal medicine like little mini handbook and this is for minor and this is for auto rhino laryngology in front of it i have my this looks like an apple but it's actually not i don't know where it's from but this is actually kind of really cool because it is like a light stand so you turn this thing on and it lights up and then right here we have my external hard drive here i have my hard post-it thingy but i ran out of it today so i need to get some new ones and then we have a light stand that i've been using ever since i was in elementary school and then at the back i have this little guy here and this is my tripod for my iPhone because as you guys know, I use my iPhone to film things and this is what I mostly use when I film my study videos or sit down videos or do my introduction and stuff so this guy is really really useful and if you take like this part out, you can take it out and you can use it as a selfie stick so that is really cool and this is by Remy I don't know if it's like only a Korean brand or something but you can switch this top part out and you can switch it to like a camera version of it so you can stick a camera on here and it is very very sturdy in the front i have this christmas mug from starbucks this is the main part of my desk and we have this little leather pad it came with the desk so i really really like it because it sets you like a boundary of your workspace on here i have my new macbook i filmed an unboxing video with it so you should definitely check it out and i love this macbook and i have this charger right here i have my favorite notebook which is from oxford and for the chair i have this which i bought from cities and this is one of the most popular brands in korea for chairs and it is very very comfortable then let's do the grand finale which is the board on my wall in front of my desk so this is the overview of it and we will just go through it really quickly because i have a lot of stuff in here and first of all these are all taylor swift photos that i got from her album and it came in this little packet here i just love the vibe of the photos the lyrics are written like under the photos and i just i really like it and i'm a huge fan of taylor so i have that moving to the right um i have this benefit and kuka kuka is a flower brand so they did like a collaboration with it and intro gave it to me so it came with a dandelion blush so that's why it looks like this and it's so pretty so i just put it up there and then this one is quite funny if you are a korean or if you know korean i'm sure you would laugh at this but this is what i wrote when i was in middle school i think this says that when studying number one don't be a perfectionist number two take everything seriously number three don't be self-satisfied and um, it might look really silly, but at the time, it just really applied to me. And by just saying these three things, it just gave me the perfect advice for studying. And then on the right, I have this Germany photo that I bought when I went there. Underneath it, I put these little pink post-its on top of my personal information because I tend to write some personal informations that I need to remember and that I don't really use that often. So this card is from the Harry Potter land and I didn't go there, my boyfriend went there and he knows that I really love Harry Potter so he got this for me and it also came with the frog, the chocolate frog and then underneath this is my um, name tag that I used in middle school and this is my Korean name if you haven't noticed. On the right we have another photo from Kuka, another one and another one and this one is a brand called Marimond um, maybe it's pronounced as Marymond in English but it is a Korean brand and it is for a good cause I will put it in the descriptions this is just called Innit and I just have it right here below it I have a Kung Fu Panda 3 poster that I told you guys that I have and it is so cute and then at the back, these are some notes that I took from a senior at school and he told me tips like specific tips for my school and how to study for each individual subject. And this, you might be wondering, like, were you pregnant or do you have a baby or something? 
And that is absolutely no. This is an ultrasound and my obstetrics professor actually observed this and he printed out to me for fun. He did it because we had time during his clinic and it was very thoughtful of him because I get to have my health examination for free. So I thought it was so cool so I just put it up there. Here I have some lyrics of the cup song. I once saw the Pitch Perfect movie and I was so hooked on that song. So I wrote it down by myself. Like, I don't know why I did it, but I wrote all of the lyrics down and just put it up. And I also learned how to do like the cup song motion, if you know what I'm talking about. And on the very right, we have this Minions movie poster and this was also a very cute one so i just put it up there yeah that is all that's on my board so that is the grand tour of my desk and i love my desk because it's very spacious and i have a lot of room to work with and i can put like multiple books and just look through it at the same time thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it thumbs up if you enjoyed and let me know what other videos you like to see in the comment section and head over to instagram to see how i'm doing in china i think i would have posted a few photos by now keep twinkling every single day and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys